tragedy tonight as a 13 year old boy has died after a car hit his bike. Officers say the collision pinned the boy against an ATV. Now officers responded near 76 in Good Hope shortly before two when they saw that crash. Our Taylor Lumpkin talked to a neighbor about the aftermath who has a message for drivers. A car accident that took the life of a 13 year old boy has left a Milwaukee family in shambles. I actually prayed and prayed for the family because th that's like a phone call that you don't want to get. Cheryl Dubois was eating lunch with her daughter Thursday afternoon when she heard a loud noise outside of her apartment. I looked at my window, I'm like, oh wow. What I saw was this truck that was tipped over. Then I just happened to see the car on the other side, the ambulances and the fire trucks and the police. According to Milwaukee police, the driver of this truck was attempting to turn off of West Denver Avenue onto North 76th Street when they crashed into another car. The other driver lost control and drove up onto the sidewalk, hitting the 13 year old boy who was on his bike. The teen was trapped between the vehicle and three ATVs. Yeah, I just thought about my family. I have a grandson, he's four, and sometimes I'd be wanting to walk him, but I'd be scared. You can still see the debris and tire marks that are left in the grass that lead all the way up to where the 13 year old was hit and killed. It's just very sad. Kids can't play outside like they used to. According to Cheryl, car accidents along 76 happen all too often. I don't know how many days that I've been woken up to hearing a boom or hearing um, sirens. It's just so many accidents and just people driving crazy. So I don't know what it is, why it is and what's going on, but it needs to stop. Now she's sharing a message for drivers in hopes that they'll become more careful on the road. Slow down. Slow down and wherever you're going, leave in enough time to get there. Just slow down. In Milwaukee, Taylor Lumpkin, TMJ4 News.